Yo, shoot. my cool style while I keep the funk with my mom. The incredible, lyrical, and original. Yo, my cool style while I keep the funk with my mom. The, the, the incredible. Yo, my cool style while I keep the funk with my mom. The, the incredible. Yo, my cool style while I keep the funk with my mom. The incredible, lyrical, and original. Hey, Cassie. <laughs> Uh, can I give you some juice first? I'll just explain what this is. Right. Come on, brothers, let's tell the brother what he wears. Let's go to Revelation 14, verse 1. Revelation 14, verse 1. This is the book of Revelation 14, verse 1. Verse 1. Then this is the future. And I looked, and lo, a lamb stood on the Mount Zion. So Mount Zion is our nation coming together. It's uh, Mangoro, uh, or Mangaro, uh, the Mangoro, yeah, the shark. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's Mount, Mount Zion. You might have to follow up our team, Mount Zion. Team, man. So read. And with him, an hundred forty and four thousand, having his father's name, Written in their foreheads. So that's what these followers have. It's their father's name yeah, written yeah. in their foreheads. So we'll go to Revelation 7 verse 2. So that's, these are the, the elect people of the Most High Creator. Oh, and these yeah. people is who the world will bow down to in the future. Today, I'm ahead of rise uh, to actually choose them. Mm -hmm. 7 and, and 3. This is from the Revelation chapter 7 verse 3. Saying, hurt not the earth, neither the sea. Nor the trees, till we have sealed the servants of our God in their foreheads. So that's what we're waiting for. It's for 144,000 men walking around New Zealand like that. And then we all go to our government, or Waka Kutama, and take over. Yeah. Yeah, but we need to have sealed men under the co op. Yeah. So get um, Psalms 37, verse 37. And this is what this is what we call uh, the most high calls. Um, because we, our God of the Bible, is a work of Psalms chapter 37 verse 37 Three. Mark the perfect man So Tama for the perfect man And behold the upright And behold too For the end of that man is peace So the end of that man is Ulamatami mm -hmm. So I can read the Pali verse Oh yeah, yeah. I'll give me Just do you hear me? Hey, he's correct Yeah, he's done by him He's correct Yeah, he's correct Too much knowledge for my book yeah, well, this is, this is, we'll read that one more time for you, my friend. Say so in the eyes of the first heart, read. Mark the perfect man. Mark the perfect man. And behold the upright. Behold the upright. For the end of that man is peace. The end of that man is peace. And how do we get peace? Declaration of independence, rulership, sovereignty. Mm. But we're going to use our Bible and the cults to show them who we are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're going to get Isaiah 41 verse 1. <laughs> I'm a master at this now. <laughs> Isaiah 41 verse 1. Keep silence before me, O Islands. So please, this one, along with this one. O Islands, which island? Get a verse 9. Thou whom I have taken from the ends of the earth. The islands at the ends of the earth, read. And for thee from the chief men thereof. It's calling for you, read. And said unto thee. Said unto you. Thou art my servant. These are the servants of the Most High. That's why you can say you're the Kaitiaki. Yeah, yeah. That's the servant of the Most High, is the Kaitiaki. Read. I have chosen thee. He's chosen you. And not cast thee away. He never cast us away. They teach that, that anyone's allowed in this now. Now we're going to go to verse uh, 15. Isaiah 41, verse 15. Still talking to the islands. Behold. I will make thee a new sharp threshing instrument, having teeth. Having what? Having teeth. So he's going to make us a new sharp threshing instrument having teeth. Now we're going to think, what would that be? So we're going to go to Judges 15 verse 15. Judges 15 verse 15. Book of Judges, chapter 15 verse 15. And he found a new jawbone of an ass. So I found a new jawbone of an ass. <laughs> So this is what the Most High is giving the people of the islands. Us Māori is this. This belongs to us. Can you go to um, Romans 9 and 4? New Testament? Because you want to use the whole Bible. 
They want to pull out all the religions from us. When it's not a religion, it's a heritage. It's a nationality of people from Ikaroa only. They say Israel. When Israel is a Yiddish word, they translate it from Ikaroa. Ikara, Ar, the ones who rest to the sun. They stole our book. This is the book of Romans, chapter 9, verse 4. Who are Israelites? Say, you are Israelites, it's us. Ikaroa. We? To whom pertaineth the adoption? The adoption? And the glory. And the glory. And the covenants. And the covenants. The kawanatana of the Messiah Creator. Read. And the giving of the law. We make you to give the law. Read. And the service of God. And the service of the Creator. Read. And the promises. And the promises. So everything in this book belongs to only you. So they read it in Revelation verse 14. Oh, 14 verse 1. I'll show you. Revelation 14 verse 1 Read. And I looked and lo A lamb stood on the Mount Zion A lamb is this Read. And with him A hundred forty and four thousand Having his father's name Written in their foreheads We need that hundred and forty four thousand men Create a sovereign nation And create stand against the world As the true guardians And you know everything That we say we are Ramatiga, Tauruma that all only pertains to us, to the children. Keep reading. And I heard a voice from heaven. Oh, I'm not going to, um, 7 verse 3, Re Revelation 7 verse 4. Book of Revelation, chapter 7 verse 4. Three. And I heard the number of them which were sealed. They were sealed. And there were sealed an hundred and forty and four thousand of all the tribes of the children of Ikaro. Yeah, that's what the Messiah means. So that's why we, we had to steal the book back, claim it back, like what Maui did. Yeah, yeah. Everything he done, we haven't done yet. So we're just going to go fulfill what he's done. So first we need the jawbone, and then us on the rope, connect it to the jawbone, and then we go straight to the sun. Come and head out, and we'll go in And I've been observing the Wellington that going down. Yeah, yeah. yeah, well that's good. Watch, observe to how we're going to do a property. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Because we're going to, it's, um, it's a law by uh, maritime law. So it will turn up in our rocker. Mm. Um, thank you for that, um, <laughs> So yeah, this is our uh, true documents. It's sitting in the courthouse for a reason. Yeah. Incredible lyrical